Hello and welcome dear friends. Thank you for joining me today. The reason for this short video is to give you a bit more information about Power Automate troubleshooting checks. And uh, also below in the links uh, in the video description you can uh, see this checklist. So I did a little bit of effort and put together a number of questions that you can use as a reference to troubleshoot your Power Automate uh, flows. So when you start troubleshooting, what are important things to take into consideration? First is, you know, to identify an error. Where does the error happen? So do you see an error somewhere in the status flow, right? So somewhere here, like uh, if the status is red, then you how you can go deeper. Is the error related to a user, to a specific user? Can it be related to a connection? Right? Can it be uh, related to a third-party connector? Or maybe it's related to the logic in the app. Right? So these are the things you should definitely keep in mind. And uh, when you do the troubleshooting, make sure you do the scoping. So to, to uh, single out and identify the exact place where the error happens. And I have a couple of uh, questions here. So for example, is it related to flow configuration? Is it related to API calls? If you have some actions which, which do API calls in your flow, can it be related to user context? Um, can it be related to data policies? For example, if your data policies allow only business connectors, then um, you know it might be the case or it can be related to specific actions in the flow. Maybe it's related to triggers, right? Or it uh, appears only in the flow history. Let's say you have a, a secure variable uh, from the key vault and then it cannot be read due to some policies. Then it would show uh, somewhere in the flow history. Um, the first place you would go is probably the status of the flow. As I mentioned, so I navigate here to home my flows and each of the flows has a status behind, right? So here it's a successful one, it's a failed one, but sometimes when even if it's successful and the logic of the flow is broken, it will not be uh, completed. So that's where you start, you know, go to status, then see what other things could be done, maybe users, connections, you know, some logic, some templates, so things like that. And you can also download this checklist, just see the, the uh, below, you know, uh, in this video description. And uh, thank you for joining me. Have a great day and stay healthy. Bye-bye.